Today, I want to talk about bugs. I don't personally hate them, it's in the middle of love and hate. I hate what they do to people, but I love to torture them. I love flies and mosquitoes because I can torture them. And in the end of their suffering, I free them. Just kidding, I kill them. It may be odd for you, but come on, just a mosquito. No big deal, right? And then I torture them, it makes my dopamine rise like crazy, and I get this feeling of control of their lives. And I can decide to never they die or stay alive. So, I'll tell you some methods of killing them plus torturing. Alright, my favorite method is hair dryer. It's when I catch them in a small box the size of much box and I heat up the box with hair dryer and their blood is boiling I can hear their quiet screams <laughs> and I enjoy it but enjoyment ends when they die the second method is have to do something with water I like to make them suffer with water because I can truly feel them suffering alright so we need that box that we used previously you catch them in that small box and you make a little opening in the box like in titanic a little little hole and through that hole is pouring water and the mosquitoes are like Nah, nah, help me. And I see them die in the water. Oh man, this is the best feeling. Third method. This is not the way to kill them, but it's a great way of torture. It's about spinning the small box so hard that the mosquito cannot fly no more. And you just let the mosquito out and it will not fly away because it's so dizzy. Fourth method. This method is like third one but it's a little bit different so you just throw the box with all your power that it could end the fly's life imagine that thinking like okay you can fly now and you just throw it with all your power and it slams the wall and boom it's dead so this is the ending part and now you can think how evil i am but i do things that i enjoy see ya